Rendezvous on A-Day. Admiral Blandy in command of Operation Crossroads. On the decks of the 73 target ships anchored in Bikini Lagoon, there is great activity. Animals are put aboard the ships taking the place of human crews in order that the experiment may show how to counteract the effects of atom bombs. A number of the sheep and goats were shorn. Special ointments were applied to determine their protective quality. Many samples of pigments, metals and fabrics were placed aboard to see how they'd react. As HR draws near, crews of the target vessels abandoned ship with their gear. Elaborate precautions were taken to see that no one had been left aboard. Captain Bibby, the last man to leave, had remained to make a final check. As he departs, the all-clear signal is seen flying. The Bikini fleet is ready. 240 miles away on Kwajalein, the atom bomb, carefully screened, is wheeled to the B-29 that's about to carry it to Bikini. Not even a glimpse of this epoch-making missile is permitted. Majors Wood and Swancutt, bombardier and pilot, coolly wait for the order to take off. Their crew has been hand-picked, and now it's time to go. Mission Crossroads has begun. Everything goes as planned, and as the aircraft nears the target, the crews are ordered to wear their special goggles to protect their eyes against the atom flash. With goggles, they saw a flash as brilliant as lightning. Those without goggles shielded their eyes with their arms as the world's fourth atom bomb fell. Following the colossal flash, a great cloud rose seven miles up into the sky. No earthquake, no tidal wave, nothing unforeseen. Some observers said this bomb was less impressive than its predecessors. Others disagreed in view of the difference in the targets. The final official verdict remains a secret. In any case, the collection of scientific information will take a long time to assess. Of the 73 target ships, five were sunk, the carrier independent was badly damaged, and the same goes for the Pensacola. Finally, another view of the explosion from a different camera position. Whatever the official verdict of this 14 million pound experiment, all can judge for themselves that the world is certainly at the crossroads. <laughs>